Hello people, I'm Phil and this is my review of the 15.10 version of Ubuntu Linux. Uh, what has changed since the last version, 15.04? Well, you're looking at about it. Um, there are almost no visual changes to the update of the operating system. The uh, search menu here has had a little bit of a chrome change so if you look along the side here there has been a slight visual change another thing that is uh, probably the most prominent change are the um, are the scroll bars so if we look here um, actually let's see so we've got let's do say let's do a cat uh, unis standard uh, you can see the scroll bar here. It's always visible, so you know where you are. And uh, it's a little bit different than the previous version. But that is about it. Let's see if we fire up web browser and go to, say, Ubuntu. Uh, that's it. That's the new scroll bar. And as far as visual changes, that is about it. Uh, for under the hood, uh, there have been a couple changes. So we now have the uh, uh, version 5 of GCC. Um, I think we're on 4.9. something with the last version. So we finally moved to 5.2. 5 and uh, we've also, there has also been an upgrade of the Linux Linux kernel um, so it's a little bit newer version of that but and then there are, you know many packages have changed under the hood stability improvements and so forth uh, people have said that this is a boring update of the uh, Ubuntu distribution but that's kind of a good thing because that means that the operating system is stable they're able to work on things like security and so forth and the big release will actually be next year, uh, April 2016. And they will introduce Unity 8 uh, with the Mir Windows Server. Uh, they're going to be replacing the X Windows Server, uh, which is still the default in this version of Ubuntu, if I'm not mistaken. But that is about it. Now, uh, if you ever wondered you know whether Linux is uh, would be good for you um, it has never been a better time to try out Linux to try out Ubuntu uh, it's very very easy to create a bootable USB drive or CD plug it into your computer boot your computer from the CD or USB and try it out before before installing and uh, it's pretty easy to do say a dual boot so you can keep your version of Windows or or Mac or whatever you'd like to run and uh, Linux is just a wonderful uh, free open source software operating system that has come a tremendous way uh, since it was since Ubuntu was originally um, introduced in 2004 it has come a long way since then you can pretty much install it on a computer and know that it will work with your hardware, with your trackpads, with your with your uh, video cams and microphones. It has drivers for everything. It's definitely an operating system that I recommend. Now there are lots of distributions of Linux. Ubuntu is just one of them. There are there are many out there, and all of them are wonderful. Uh, but Ubuntu is probably one of the one of the most uh, famous and popular distributions of Linux. And so if you're thinking about trying it out, now is a great time. They have the latest version with all the security updates. It's a great time to try it out. Thank you guys for watching. I'll be back next time with more uh, assembly language videos.